Hey, what's going on guys? It's your boy Dominic or Spider Lash here and today I wanted to talk about or discuss about Street Fighter V's new addition to the roster and the new addition to Season 2, Akuma. Now there's a few things I gotta say about Akuma, okay? Akuma's cool. I think he's cool, but he could be too overpowered. So in the trailer, I'll, I'll sh if you guys want, hit the like button on this video, but I'll show you the guys the trailer tomorrow, maybe. And in the trailer, he has like a lion's mane, like it makes him look like a lion. I mean, that's pretty cool, I kind of like that, but it just doesn't look like Akuma, you know what I mean? Like Akuma's got like the short hair, he's got all frizzed up, but I, I like the way they took, they took a new design route, and I like that. It, it was a cool way of doing it. Now the gameplay for him is really weird. So for the gameplay, pretty much he's like Akuma and Third Strike, but on steroids mixed with like four four like I don't know just I guess like four ultra steroids I guess but they made Akuma look so good he looks overpowered I'm not gonna lie he's got like a launcher button now like he can just launch him up in the air do like EX Tatsu he can do all of this stuff and he just looks broken beyond belief his demon flip is multi-hitting if you use his EX one he looks really good like, he looks broken good. But I know they'll have something, because he, he, he's not going to have a lot of health. I already know that. It's Akuma. He's gonna, he has to trade health for offense, but he's looking really good, guys. Like, really, really, really good. And I just wanted to say, like, Akuma's going to be top top 7. I already know he's going to be top 7. Okay, it's, it's obvious... Just because, but also, they making nerfs to season two. They just they're nerfing these top seven characters so much, and it's so good they're nerfing them because they're giving characters like Geef more, like Geef, like Birdie. You don't see Birdie. You don't see who else. You barely see Vega. You don't see people like Laura. Well, I mean maybe Laura, but you don't see Geef. You don't see Vega. You don't see like Fong. You never see Fong, and Fong is really good. You don't see any of those, but no, you know who you see? You see, well, you, not really much Ryu, but, I mean, yeah, Ryu, you see, oh, he gets characters like Alex. We need buffs on Alex, okay? His, he pretty much, they nerfed Third Strike. They took Third Strike, Alex, and nerfed him. Why? He was already bought, like, low tier. You made him, like, junk tier. But, they need to buff him. Yurian? I can see him getting a couple buffs, like, you know what would be really cool is if EX shoulder charge, like, they could change that, and instead of it, like, hitting him on the ground, it could be, like, third strike, and hits him back up in the air, and you can do, it like, another shoulder charge, and then, like, his little karate chop. Now, if you guys want to hear me discuss Yurian, let me know down in the comments below, but, yeah, I mean, it's just kind of weird. It's like, Akuma, we already knew he was coming for it, okay? Because of the little trailer, but he looks so good. Oh my god. Whew. He looks like a really overpowered character. It's insane, though. But we also, and I will show you the trailer tomorrow with my reaction. But I've already seen it, but I'll, be, I'll go through it and analyze what there is. But season 2 is coming with 6 additional characters. Besides Akuma. All I want is 12 or Remy. I want one of them to come back. Well, maybe not Remy, just because we already have like two boom characters. I don't think we need another one. It would be cool if we had Remy. If you have like three boom characters. But, um, yeah, like Oro. Get them. Get third strike characters. Hey, bring some alpha characters. Bring Sodom into this. He hasn't been in like the game in a while. Bring characters from Alpha 3, man. I mean, bring back the. The final fight, guys. Bring back Cody. Bring back Guy. Jeez, I mean, I understand if it was a widely loved character, but they hit the gold when they announced Alex and Yurian. They hit the gold. Everybody was hyped for them. Jury was even hyped. Jury is really cool. Abuki's really good. Balrog's really good. They're all good. But the only thing I could really say is we need to bring back third strike characters. We need to bring them from the dead. 
Okay, we got like Sodom, bro. Sodom was really cool. He was like a grappler, but he also had like a Rekka. And it was like super cool. Maybe, well, maybe, I don't know. I was about to say bring back Relento, but Relento would be really cool. I wouldn't mind seeing him. But, like I said, just leave some suggestions on what kind of characters you want to hear about in third and five. Because I'm getting five when season two comes out, so this could be fun. <laughs> I'm going to be honest with you guys, Street Fighter V right now is really cool, and I, I know I don't play it because I have it on my computer and it doesn't run that good, so I don't want to like make it look all crappy, but um, what was I going to say, but yeah, so hopefully for Christmas I get 5, I will be getting 5, Marvel Infinite, no I didn't talk about this at all, but they released the gameplay trailer, and and it looks like Marvel superheroes with Capcom characters, like, in 3D. Nothing's different about it, I mean. Thought it'd be a little bit cooler. This kinda looks stupid. But they're bringing back Ultimate Marvel. I forgot to say that. They're bringing back Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom 3 on PC, on PS4, on Xbox. I'm getting it for PC, I don't care. I'm getting it for PC and PS4. It's gonna be awesome. I love Marvel. Marvel's like my favorite game of all time. But I'll, I'll see what this one's about. I'll get it. I'll get Marvel Infinite. But I just, I want to know what the game's about. Like, I want to know what kind of characters. Bro, the one character that they're going to hook me on, if they release this character, I will explode. Okay? They release my boy Venom. I'm gonna buy the game no matter what. Okay, they release Venom, I'm buying the game. I don't care what anybody says, I'm buying the game. Venom is life. If they release Venom, he'd be so cool! Capcom, please release Venom! I'm pretty much sold they release Venom. Like, I'm 100% sold. Like, you pretty much got my vote, I'll buy the game. They release Venom. It's Christmas is coming up, so I mean... Or the holidays, I'm sorry. But, it's coming up, and... They release Venom for the game. They do like what Street Fighter V did and kind of like over time release characters for the game. They were put Venom in the game. I'm, I'm gonna buy the game. I'll buy it. I'll buy like four copies of it, but I'm buying the game. Getting it for PS4 and PC. I'll get it. And it's gonna be awesome because I love Street Fighter. I love Venom. They're my favorite characters. So thank you guys for listening to my rambling. <laughs> I know I ramble a lot, but hit that like button blow it up it does support the channel and if you guys want to hear more stuff like this leave a comment down in the comments below subscribe to me become a part of the Slender Wolf Alliance and I will see you guys later peace out